First, take out of all items from the package. There are monitor, camera, sunshade, 43 extension cord, 23 extension cord, U bracket, windshield mount, lighter adapter, screws, extension cord, power cord and T-taps. Follow my operation. Pick up the windshield mount. Loosen the screws. Align the windshield mount with the hole on the back of the monitor. Follow my operation. Tighten the screws. The bracket can be flexibly adjusted. Paste it on the bottom of the monitor bracket. Pull up the buckle. Place the monitor where you want, and pull down the buckle to fix it. Follow my operation. Now remove the windshield mount. Now demonstrate how to install the U-bracket. Install the sunshade on the monitor. Like my way. Align the bracket hole with the screw hole. Tighten the screws. Repeat the above operation. Like my way. The U-bracket can be adjusted flexibly. After adjusted the angle, tighten the screws. Pick up the 3M sticker. Install the antenna on the cam. Take out the screws. Use screws to fix the camera and bracket. Pick up 43 feet extension cord. Follow my operation. Connect one end of the extension cable to the camera. There are two wires CH1 and CH2 on the monitor extension cable. Connect the other end of the extension cord to the CH1 extension cord of the monitor. Put the waterproof cover on the screw to prevent rainwater from entering. Pick up the cigarette lighter. Connect the cigarette lighter to the DC connector of the extension wire. Plug the adapter to the power. Press the red button. The red button lights up. Like my way. The monitor lights up and the image appear on the screen. If the 43 feet cable is not long enough, you can use the 23 feet cable. Disconnect the monitor. Connect the 43 feet wire to the 23 feet extension wire. Tighten the screws. Then connect the 43 feet wire to the monitor extension wire. The monitor lights up and the image appear on the screen. Now introduce the function of the monitor. The first key to turn on, off the screen. In this case, the second key and the third key have no effect. Touch the CH key to switch to the CH2 channel. Touch the CH key again to switch to the split mode. Touch the CH key again to switch to the CH1 channel. Touch the menu key to enter menu mode. Touch the up or down key to switch to the playback. Press the OK key to confirm. No card appears on the screen, indicating that the card has not been inserted. There is no playback function in this case. Touch the menu key to return to the previous interface. Touch the up or down key to switch to the video. Touch the OK key to quit the menu mode. Turn off the monitor's power.
Now demonstrate how to insert the SD card. Use tools to remove the back cover of the monitor. Now introduce the function of the monitor. Close the back cover. Tighten the screws. Touch the CH key to switch the camera to channel. There is a red flashing dot in the upper left corner, indicating that it is recording. Touch the OK key to turn off the record. Touch the CH key again to switch the split mode. the CH key again to switch the camera. The monitor is recording. When recording, you cannot enter the menu mode by touching the menu key. Touch the OK key to turn off the record. Touch the menu key to enter menu mode. Touch the up or down key to switch to the playback. Press the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down key to select the video you want. Touch the OK key to confirm. Video is playing back. Turn off the camera's power and quickly turn off. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the picture. Touch the OK key to confirm. The image appears on the monitor, means Touch the up or down key to switch the delete current. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to adjust the brightness. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the menu key. The protect can lock the video to prevent deletion. Touch the up or down keys to adjust the contrast. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down key to switch to the video. Touch the OK key to quit the menu mode. Touch the menu key to enter menu mode. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the hue. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down key to adjust the brightness. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down key to switch to the contrast. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to adjust the volume. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down key to switch to the color. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down key to adjust the color. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down key to switch to the loop recording. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the mode. Touch the OK. Touch the up or down key to select the two minutes. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to select the last button. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down key to turn on, off the motion detection. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down key to switch to the mirror. Touch the OK key to confirm. You can turn off the mirror of all channels, or turn on CH1 or CH2 mirror. Touch the up or down key to select the off mirror. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the menu key to switch to the system. Touch the up or down key to switch to the date, time. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to turn off the camera one. Touch the OK key to confirm. Adjust month, day, hour, minute, second in turn. Like my way. Touch the menu key to return to the previous interface. Touch the up or down key to switch to the language. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to turn on the camera one. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down key to switch to the formal. Touch the OK key to confirm. After you insert the SD, please format the SD card first.
Touch the up or down keys to adjust the scan time. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the auto scan. Touch the OK key to confirm. Follow my operation. Touch the up or down key to select the OK key restore factory settings. Touch the OK key to confirm. When you have pictures for both channels, the monitor will automatically switch channels. Touch the up or down key to adjust the VCOM. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down keys to switch to the system. Touch the OK key to confirm. You can check the version information here. Touch as the menu key to quit the menu mode. Touch the OK key to turn on the record. Touch the OK key again to turn off the record. Touch the V key to turn on the guidelines. Touch the V key again to turn off the guidelines after you adjust all the parameters. The parameters cannot be saved when the power is turned off directly. Now turn on the monitor's power. Long touch the power key. When the good BYB appear on the screen, data is being saved. Turn off the monitor's power and power on. Data saved successfully. Please note, as long as the parameters are adjusted, long press the power key to save. Pick up the second camera, license plate camera. Insert SD card. Align the camera hole with the license plate hole. Fix the camera and license plate with screws. Pick up the extension wire. Connect one end of the extension cable to the license plate camera. Connect the other end of the extension cable to CH2 on the monitor extension cable. Now it is CH1 channel. Touch the CH key to switch to the CH2 channel. Touch the OK key to turn off the record. Touch the CH key to switch to the split mode. Both CH1 and CH2 channel images appear on the monitor. The process of connecting the camera to the lamp line. T-taps. T-taps has two holes and one hole is closed. The long line is the line of the lamp or the circuit line on the car. Thrust the car light line into the first hole. camera power cord. Plug the power cord into the second hole. Iron sheets. Clamp the iron sheet to the tap's bottom.